Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we are here with the Let's Play series once again. So we're starting the brand new one now. I forgot what the new one is. Uh, oh yeah, Tibi Sinus. So I probably said that wrong, but yeah, we're going to be doing that one guys. So Chaos Lord Tibi Sinus. So for the first one, we need to go to Sand Sea Port and click Go there. So yeah, once we're here, uh, we need to accept this guy's quests. Uh, I'm going to quickly change class here. Because I know we have to kill a lot of monsters. <laughs> Nothing unusual. But yeah, click on uh, Zoom and click on Quests. Now click on the first one and accept. Um, so we basically just have to move around Sand Sea and see. So as you can see, there's a Sand Shark. It's quite healthy. And uh, it's kind of annoying to get up on this map. Um, it, it's a bit confusing at times. Anyway, all you want to do is go to the left. And just keep walking down sand so you explore every room until the quest gets accepted basically it shows us a room that we're going to eventually get to at some point but yeah as you can see uh this uh, kind of gives us an idea where all the monsters are so yeah these guys are pretty healthy over here as you can see six thousand health so i'm gonna go back and accept it now it should have um uh, made the quest guy appear or something now i have to go all the way back even though auto turned into it didn't really matter if it auto turned in or not, but oh well. We're gonna go back and uh, try and get, try and accept the next quest if we can maneuver around this map. Oh my goodness! Okay, so oh no, nope. <laughs> click on zoom. Okay, so the next one is shark diving. That's pretty obvious. You definitely have to kill these sand sharks. Um, really seems simple, but yeah, I'm just gonna check if I get the quest drop or not. Alright guys, I'll be back once I get 8 of these. Alright guys, we completed the quest, so we're going to go back and turn it in. So it did take a little bit of time, uh, because the monsters had a lot of health. But it did have a 100% drop, which was nice. So now we're going to go to Thieving Cutthroats over here, and we're going to go to get the uh, Tomb Robbers. So the reason I'm not reading it is because it's fairly obvious in the uh, quest uh, pickup items, if you could, if you want to call it that. So yeah, um... It's pretty obvious just to confirm anyways because sometimes they do that but then there's something else you have to kill but yeah uh, I'm just going to confirm guys. So yes I'll be back once I get 10 of these. Alright guys we're done with the quest so yeah we're going to go back and turn it in. Fairly easy. Um, yeah guys I really recommend getting the pirate classes coming out very soon uh, because basically it's seasonal so it's not out at the moment it comes around once a year. So turn this in and now, oh we got Sansi rank 2. So now you want to go to Lost and Found. So now we need to get the precious Sansi relic. It looks like we need to just um, bring back the 14 missing Sansi relic. Okay, it looks like we just have to move around the map collecting stuff. Um, if I'm correct. Let's see if that's the case. Well, it doesn't look like it's this. It is a shame to think some people and sharks stoop so low for a little extra jingle in their gold, pu gold purses. Tomb robbers and sand sharks have stolen precious sand sea treasures. Okay, so it looks like we need to kill tomb robbers and sand sea sharks, um, up to 14 of them. Hopefully, it is a 100% drop rate, otherwise, it's going to be tilting. And I'm going to get triggered, guys. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to see. Okay, yeah, so that's what we have to do. It looks like it's a 100% drop rate, but that's based on one kill. So, yeah, guys, um, I will be back once I've got 14 of this. Alright guys, we are done with the quest. It did take a lot of time, guys. <laughs> um, but yeah. So yeah, guys, we're going to go and turn in the quest. Um, I know the last one is going to be to be with the uh, hawks at the end of the map. But I hope we don't have to kill much of them. If we have to kill something like 20, I I'm going to get triggered right away. So, here we go. So, oh, we only have to kill like 3. Um... Why is it separated? It's exactly the same thing. So apparently I think we need to kill... Uh, why didn't it just put it in four? Oh well. It looks like we have to defeat every single one that's there. Uh, we can't defeat the same one over and over, but... That's what I skimmed through. I don't know if that's like 100% because I didn't really read it properly. So let's see what we have to do. Um, they're all this, They all have the same name, so I don't know. It's kind of weird. Uh, but let's test it out guys. I'm just going to check if we can uh, get the item of this guy or not. I don't really know. 
So we get, okay, one out of three in there. So if I kill the last one, let's see if it gets the bottom one. Because if it does, then it'd make a bit more sense to me. So, yeah. I'm going, oh yeah, guys, um, I want to talk about something quickly. Um, uh, recently on my videos, I really appreciate the huge support, guys. Uh, you guys have been commenting the every single video, so thank you guys for doing that. And also, uh, live streams are going to be less frequent now, guys, because um, I'm getting pretty busy. Like, when I was live streaming, I had nothing to do. But yeah, um, <laughs> the reality is that I've got stuff to do. So yeah, guys, I will be live streaming less. Maybe on the weekends. I don't know. It's going to be random, though, guys. So I'd expect uh, not as many views. Uh, or viewers while on the live streams because I'm not that frequent but yeah guys um, videos are gonna be my main thing because they don't take as long like when I live stream it takes three to four hours and then yeah so when I make a video it takes like half an hour to an hour to record uh, an hour to two hours to edit depending on the video and it's not too bad for me because I can do it at any time. But live streaming, you have to do it all in one go. So it's pretty difficult for me. So yeah, hope you guys understand. Um, we complete the quest, so we're going to go and turn it in again. Not again, but just go to the person and click quests. So yeah, let's go. Um, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, live stream. Not live stream. I hope you guys are enjoying the Let's Play series and my new series which I made. Um, is it worth... Uh, the class um, so you get there was pretty good feedback on that so we're gonna turn it in now we have completed the quest guys uh, sell sword sellouts so now there's a cutscene we can't even skip it guys make sure you spam the next button let's go spam 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 guys I hope you guys can hear my uh, mouse click spam Ooh, that's the chaos lord right here oh no Ooh, what's going on here guys That looked dodgy, guys. <laughs> it, they never usually show the Chaos Lord that early. Oh, well. So, yeah, guys, for the next episode, uh, we're going to go to the next part, which is in Sekduat Pyramids. So, we're going to be doing this place next, guys. Oh, no. This this place, I'm just going to tell you guys, this place is really annoying. I remember doing the quest line for this. It was so painful because the things weren't dropping and the monsters are pretty healthy. Okay, 3k, 5k. So, yeah, guys, next episode, we're going to be doing the most painful thing uh, in AQW of getting things that we don't actually get. So, thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoy this series or enjoy this video in particular, please leave a like and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.